Okay, I think it is recording. And let me see. This is where I have to stay in the thing. Okay. I went ahead and did Jennifer Evers uh, Mixed Media Challenge in her group Quality Crafts. And this is what I made. Um, it had to use two different mediums. Well, at least two different mediums. So I used Distress Ink and I used this Shimmer Mist. And I um, used these stencils to do the background. And then I sprayed it with this and then I blotted it with a paper towel. Um, I cut these letters from this paper and then the rest just came out of my uh, bucket and I pulled out this stuff to use and this is what I came up with. I know this is a die cuts with a view um, piece of chipboard but I don't know what set it is from. And these are all just miscellaneous die cuts. Everything else on here is a miscellaneous die cut from a previous project. And uh, some little extra bits of bling. And right there. And the feathers even came out of my little bucket from a previous project. And uh, these little, they're Prima. I know that. I think they're a lyric. I don't know. And this is just a doily I crumpled up and inked, sprayed, and that. Here is a little piece of um, trim, like lace. And that's it. Um, these are just little pieces of this. And the stars came from, I don't know, just something miscellaneous. But this is what I did. For the challenge in uh, quality crafts. I like it. And when I got to done making it. I was like really hyped. To make something else. I enjoyed making it. This was not my first attempt. At first I tried painting something. And that was not it. So then I got out all the sprays that I own. And I started spraying stencils and. That wasn't going to work either, so this is what I ended up with. I like it, and I'm going to do another page someday soon. So that is that. Then I want to show you um, my new stamp set, and it is from Pink Bowties, and you can find it at pinkbowties.biz www.pinkbowties.biz And there is a companion set to this with a little girl in a dress and she's so cute, she's got a little purse and more hair and uh, that one is for people who went to college and were in sororities. So you might want to check that one out too. This one says, kinky girl, big hair don't care, slay them with your hair on your birthday, material girl, in love with my hair, have a good hair day, beauty is being the best possible version of yourself on the inside and out, life is too short to have boring hair, I woke up like this, these are all hashtags right here and it's hashtag natural hair journey, hashtag product junkie, hashtag natural girl hair problems. Nope, just natural girl problems. And that's it. I think it's so cute and I'm going to make a card with this later on and uh, I'll show it to you guys when I get it done. Hence the button. That's what the button was for. So you guys have a really nice Thursday and it really is getting closer to the weekend. If you want an update on my back, I'll tell you. Um, ends up, I have had a kidney stone. I have since passed it and it was excruciatingly painful. 
but it's gone and my back is better and I'm back to walking and this morning I went on such a long walk. It was very nice. It was a beautiful morning. We woke up, it was in the 40s. So beautiful. And today we're going to get in the 60s and tomorrow 68. That is really warm compared to the 25 degrees we had one night like two weeks ago. But cold weather is coming. I just feel it in my bones. So y'all have a very nice uh, weekend. But I'm also going to apologize for my video that I posted yesterday, the paper pumpkin video. And it had like five views, so I know somebody watched it. I wasn't disappointed in the paper pumpkin stuff. I was just kind of disappointed it wasn't a card kit. But it's okay, I got over it. I'm gonna make cards out of it anyhow. So that's good, I liked it, it was all right. I don't know if I'm like completely thrilled. I hope next month is really a lot better because maybe it'll be Christmassy since this was thankful. Yeah, I think so. All right. See you guys uh, after I make this card. Bye. Oh, now turning it off is a problem, huh?